So, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my new video. This video is about Stoneheart. Now, Stoneheart um, is a game where you create a city with your minions and you gather resources, you create buildings, you defend your city from monsters, all that kind of stuff. Um, it will have multiplayer in the full first ga in the in the full release, where um, you can build with a friend or wage wars against each other, which is really cool. Um, I got Alpha because I backed it on Kickstarter, which is fucking awesome. This game has a lot of potential, and I love it. I can't wait for updates. So let's. Uh, dive right into it so there you go this is the world um, with the rise mode button you can rotate the camera with the left mouse button you can drag and um, go across the map with the scroll wheel you can zoom in and zoom out that's like the, the camera um, stuff you'll need now first you gotta pick a place where you wanna build and you gotta keep in mind that you'll need berries and wood to survive and build stuff so I'm gonna place my banner that looks nice but this looks nice too so I'm gonna place it right there that will spawn my little minions and now I'll create a stockpile for them to place all the goods so there you go that's the stockpile they will create or place the wood yep okay got it now I'm gonna collect the wood, so I'm selecting the trees and chopping them. So what you wanna do to, um, like, don't encounter that much bugs, is get a lot of wood first, and then start building. So try not to build stuff and gather wood at the same time, because that might bug out the game. So I'm going to chop all of these trees, gather all that wood in the stockpile, and then get the berries. Let's hope we'll be able to create like a couple beds before night, which might be... No, I don't think that I can do that. But anyway, look at, look at the art. I love this art. It's like cubicle. Um, it's simple, and it it works it's like minecraft it works <laughs> so let's fill this stockpile now as you'll see when i select this berry and select gather berries um, they will drop what they're doing at least one of them will drop what he's doing and go for the berries so let's see he will probably go for the berries now. There you go. And those two will go for these berries. So after they pick them, they will create like a little basket. And when they're hungry, as you can see, they will pick up a plate and eat up. And we might have a bug here already. Just standing still with this little plate. Nope, okay. That one better than expected. So now they will take the basket, place it in the stockpile and clean up this wood. Now what I want to do is create not a structure, no, but a workshop. I want to create the carpenter. So I'm going to place this guy over here. Like right there. And then create a little stockpile for him to place his cre uh, crafted goods in there you go now one of them will place the block over there create this little what is it tree stump and from there I'll be able to select a carpenter so I select this carpenter workbench promote somebody choose a citizen I'm just gonna randomly select that one and then click on approve and then we'll get a cool animation. There you go. Do 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 do. Zelda chest mode. Yep. So that's our carpenter right now. Now what you can do with the carpenter is is create stuff. You can create fences. 
a fence gates, uh, chairs, tables, beds, and weapons and armor. So what we're going to do is create a couple beds. So I'm going to create three beds, craft. Now what she's going to do is gather the wood, place it on the bench and create the 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 items we selected. So I'm going to gather those berries, get some more wood. And it's it's starting to get dark now, so that will light the fire pit in a second. <laughs> and it's the last part. Ah, oh, we got one bed done though. So we're gonna place the bed, select the bed, place item. Let's place it right there. Yep, I'm gonna pick it up and build it over there. So there you go, there's the light, gonna light the fire pit, there you go, that will keep them warm in the night. So as you can see, they might get sleepy, um, when you build beds, you, um, you'll you be able to like uh, rest better I guess, they give like bonuses. Uh, if they're too tired to walk to the bed, they will just fall on the ground and sleep and then you get one of these messages down here that says no barrel awakes groggy from sleeping on the cold hard unforgiving earth which is actually pretty cool like the feedback from your villages I'm gonna get us some more berries we got some berries though but they were they regrow so you can use them infinitely and where is our carpenter there you go she's eating she will create the last bed and I want the, that tree to go down and after that we'll start building some uh, we're gonna build a wall uh, a table and a chair just to show you guys some stuff like a picket fence a fence gate a simple wooden chair a table for one there you go she can create that and in the me meanwhile, we're gonna build a little house once they've picked up all the wood. Now this is a fence, let's place a little fence over here. Place it over there. So, I had a little problem there, but I'm back. So, what we're gonna do is place this simple chair I want the chair over there I want the wooden gate over here and I want the table to be in front of the chair <coughs> so we built some stuff now as you can see a little fence with a gate a chair a table Let's see if we can craft like a sword and a buckler, but I, I don't know if I can equip those on the, the guys yet. I don't think so actually. So, um, come on, get that wood guys. When we're done with the wood gathering, like, yeah, it's only a couple, couple parts. And then we're gonna create a wooden wall. Betty. and then I'm gonna create this wall so structures wall loop I'm gonna build a wall over here like place two columns and they will create a wall in between now as they're building the wall they uh, actually built scaffolding to get higher to the higher points and the funny thing is that when you're done building the wall they will actually break down the scaffolding and use that scaffolding um, like like get the wood back from the scaffolding and place it back in the stockpile which is cool and realistic as you can see the blue blocks are actually like uh, a stair or a ladder 
but it's not it's not implemented yet so they'll just get to the blue block and then go slowly up I don't think the animation is there yet now I don't like this because this might actually be a bug we're encountering right now which is not funny let's craft something and hope that that fixes it or select some berries oh god why now they might move if I place this right there no okay well oh wait a minute that might uh, that might fix it let's hope let's hope so they got hungry they picked up a plate and they might actually go back to doing what they were doing as you can see this little guy is smart and he goes sit down at the table and the chair although he doesn't really use the table for his plate which is kind of silly, but they'll have to do picket fence. Oh wait, they didn't build that yet. Escape this one, because if you if you like see this, they haven't placed it yet. So when you select that thing again and place it somewhere else, this will not disappear. So it's better to wait a second. Now let's see what are they gonna do now. <laughs> I think they lost the pathfinding. Or they don't wanna finish the wall. One of the two. Let's see if uh, what happens when I build uh, the simple room. Uh, let's place it right there. Bam. Okay. They don't wanna finish the wall. Yeah, who cares about a wall anyway? Let's create a room. Now I I see that the carpenter is not doing anything. So I guess he she's not gonna help out when um when your minions what the hell is that? Oh, okay, that's weird. That guy just picked up a basket and started crafting this this wall and now it's missing the lowest two parts of the support col uh, column. <laughs> Which is kind of funny. <laughs> but alpha, 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 alpha. Anyway, this is actually all I can show you guys because there's nothing more in the in the alpha as of now but it looks really promising and I will I would love to see more of this so I'm gonna end the video here um, you you see what you can do in this game it's it's awesome you can pick it up at the humble store um, it's um, 30 dollar if you want the alpha and beta and 15 dollar if you want the complete game but you can get the complete game as of yet so you'll have to wait I'm not sure what the actual uh, release date is but I think it will be somewhere in um, 2014 which we just went into so uh happy new year guys <laughs> i almost forgot that part anyway i'm gonna i'm gonna end this video over here and uh, i hope you enjoyed it so um leave a comment like subscribe do whatever you want see you guys